you might have a web page. For example, here I have index.html, and when I click on it, it opens up in uh, Chrome. So you might be wondering, how can I get this web page onto the internet? If I look at the bar here at the moment, it's directing me to where this file is saved onto my computer. But no one can access this because the file is saved only for me on my computer. In order for people to access my web page, I would need to host this file on what we call a web server. So a computer basically that is connected to the internet at all times. Glitch.com is a service that allows me to host a, web, a simple website for free. You can create an account. I'm already logged in here, so it's not prompting me to create an account. But if you were not logged in, if you didn't have an account, you could create one using your uh, Google or your Gmail account would be the easiest. Once you're logged in, you'll see your icon here and you can go to new project and start a new website. By default, Glitch will give me uh, a starting site. So it will give me some HTML code that I can start with as well as some CSS. Um, so I don't want this page because I already have my own. So on the left here, I can see all different files. The one that I'm interested in is the HTML file, so I'll come here and actually delete that because I want to import my own. We can even delete the other two files that we see here or leave them. We don't need them, so might as well delete them at this point. I will go and get my file, so upload. I had saved it here, so I'm going to click index and open it up. And here I see the code for my first web page. If we go to the bottom of this glitch, here we can see a preview button. If you click on it, you can say preview in new window. And there you have it. This is my web page and is now hosted on the web. And this is my domain name. If I want to change the domain name, I can go back to glitch dashboard and go to settings, edit project details, and I could call it whatever I want here. So it's going to give me, it will be this name dot glitch dot me. That will be my domain name. Um, So let's, let's say I call it this, and the domain is already in use. Somebody else has used this. So we would have to try different things. Uh, I'm trying to think of something. Okay, so <laughs> let's see. So I tried just this name here, blue site, and it worked. So blue site .glitch .me, you can try different things to see uh, if you wanted to customize your domain name. So that's it. My web page is now uh, hosted on Glitch for free. And I can share this domain name to the world. Or it was actually, that's the old window. So if I refresh or if I re-preview in the new, there it is, blue site .glitch .me. So feel free to modify the text as well. You can modify it directly here and you don't need to go in the notepad on your computer anymore.